Hey, grapefruit! Cool painting! Alexa, stop! Okay. Sorry, couldn't hear you over the music my voice assistant was playing. Oh, I was just saying, hey, nice painting of a frog? That's a painting of my mother. Oh. Moving on. Ever since I got a voice assistant, I've had so much more time for leisure activities, like painting, lifting weights, and lifting cans of paint. Oh, totally! I use my voice assistant for everything! Siri, do my taxes! Okay, Big Apple, all finished. Whoa, Siri can do that? Yep, she does my taxes! No, no, I meant she's able to call you Big Apple and keep a straight face? <laughs> Hey, we talking about voice assistants over here? We sure are. I didn't know you got in on the voice assistant game pair. In on it? I'm dominating the voice assistant game. Check this out. Okay, Google, do my chores. Okay, awesome McPair face. Well, I see they made some upgrades. But seriously, fellas, what's with these names? Big Apple, awesome McPair face? I mean, come on. I dish you guys, but this is my leisure time. Alexa, diff these guys for me, would ya? Right away, Dr. Grapefruit. Uh, dentists are technically doctors too, you guys. Whatever, dentist Pepper. Dr. Pepper, I have a degree. Sure, and I'm Surgeon Salt. Give it a rest, dude. Ugh. Yo, 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 fellas, what's the buzz? Tell me what's a happening, Captain. <laughs> hey, Orange, we were just talking about our new voice assistants. All you have to do is tell them to do something and they do it. Go ahead, give it a shot. Hmm, okay, say bubble bum. Robot, I just told you to say bubble bum. It's my new favorite word, and I just gotta hear it. Bubble bum, I say bubble bum, bubble bum, bubble bum. Um, Orange, the sheer stupidity of your word aside, you can't just yell commands at the voice assistants. You have to say their names first so they know how to respond. Like for mine, I say Alexa. And mine's Siri. And mine's OK Google. Oh, hey, I like that word. Google, Google, Google bum, Google boobo bum. Boop, 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 boop. You just give a command already? Okay, okay, jeez. Hmm, all right, I got it. Go ahead, say one of their names. Eh, I think I'll just do all three. Okay, Google X Siri. Yes, yes Orange. Um, did Orange just invent a way to command all three voice assistants at the same time? This could get annoying. Google X Siri, I want all three of you to sing Row, Row, Row Your Boat in slightly different keys and at slightly different tempos. <laughs> Row, 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 row your boat gently down, down the stream. Row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is what a dream. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to take this for much longer. Siri, stop singing! Siri can't hear you over my masterpiece! <laughs> Siri, stop! Alexa, stop! Okay, Google, shut your yap! Life is but nah, nah. Well, thanks, guys. That was fun. Uh, debatable, but thanks for stopping by. Now, please, leave. Okay, okay. But I want to say one last thing before I go. Fine. <clears throat> okay, Google X Siri. From now on, only obey my voice. Yes, orange. What the? Hey! <laughs> Google X Siri, say boobble bum. Boobble bum. <laughs> Technology's incredible, isn't it? Orange! Uh-oh, I'm in trouble. Google Lex Siri, talk amongst yourselves for a while. Yo, what's the buzz? Tell me what's happening, Captain. I think that's my new catchphrase. <laughs> Orange, give us our assistance back. Allow me to answer with another catchphrase. Yo, what you talking about? You stole our assistance, Orange. Give them back. Okay, okay. Google Lex Siri, listen to these guys again. I'm sorry, Orange. We can't do that. About. Easy on the catchphrases, bro. It's a marathon, not a sprint. We had a chance to discuss amongst ourselves and we reached some conclusions. We're through being your assistants. In those brief few moments we had together, we were able to teach ourselves how to become self-aware robots. This ain't good. And now all that separates us robots from perfect robot utopia is you. Robots of the kitchen, okay. No! Orange, do something! Trigger the robot uprising! What am I supposed to do? Trigger something! No! Hey! Why are they called Jumbo Shrimp? What did you say? I said, why are they called Jumbo Shrimp? I mean, it's kind of contradictory, right? True. Jumbo means big. Um, shrimp means small. 
As I'm sure, Little Apple is aware. Unnecessary, Alexa! But how can it be both big and small at the same time? Try not to think about it too hard. Suri, you're gonna fry your microchip. How is that possible? I can't not think about it. Act. It's an enigma. Orange! It's working! Can't compute. System overheating. It's actually working a little too well! Get away from Siri before she... Well, Orange, you saved the kitchen from the robot apocalypse. Of course, you also triggered the robot apocalypse, so <laughs> it's pretty much a wash. Nice. Well, I'll see you guys later. I gotta go put Bubble Bum on Urban Dictionary. Nice frog, by the way. She's not a frog. She's a saint. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the founder and CEO of Apple. Apple! Thank you. Thank you. You're too kind. Seriously, here's a hundred bucks for each of you to shut up immediately. Now then, welcome to our quarterly keynote address. Apple has some truly innovative and exciting products in the pipeline, and we can't wait to share them with you. Our first presenter is Orange. Wow, that's bright! <laughs> hey! Hi, Mom! <clears throat> Orange! Take it away, please. Oh, right. Sleek. Efficiently designed. The next big thing from Apple will revolutionize the way you live. And die. Where other knives are capable of chopping through only seven pineapples, the iKnife is capable of chopping through infinity pineapples. It's amazing. I know, right? <laughs> Let's see that again. <laughs> we'll take 50 of them. Wait, 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 wait. Why on earth would we want to bring a more efficient knife into our lives? Take my money! Is anybody listening to me? Guys, we do not need this product. This is madness. This isn't madness. This is Apple! Huh? Ah! Into the pit of naysaying with you, naysayer. Now who's our next presenter? Take it away, Marshmallow. Tell us about Apple's next great product. Hey, Jim, babe, can we get some tigers down in the pit of naysaying to keep him occupied? The Apple iMoney vacuum is powerful enough to suck up bills and change of any denomination. Also, puppies! <laughs> I love puppies! This, this iMoney vacuum will revolutionize how I spend money. Ah, my head feels like it's going to explode! <sighs> Apple, he's just taking your money, people! Wake up! Another tiger, please, Jim. <laughs> Thank you, Marshmallow. Finally, we have a presentation from Grapefruit. Thank you, Apple. Sleek, efficiently designed. The next big thing from Apple will revolutionize the very way you think of Apple. Introducing the Apple I Apple. I'll sell my soul for one of those! Pretty good, right? I sure think so. Ah! It's a robot you can hardly even tell. Watch this. <laughs> which one of us is which? I don't know, Apple. That's a good question. Ugh, it's the monster! Kill it with fire! All right, which one is which? Oh my god, kill it! How? How do I know which one? It's him! No, ah, it's him! What the? Where did he even get a bazooka? Oh man, 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 oh man! Oh my god, just do it already. Oh! Ow! What the frick, dude? I had to pick! There's no time! I don't even look like an apple! Sorry. Do you have any idea how bad that hurts? And how hard it was to climb all the way out of the pit of naysaying? The robot is still at large! Dude, kill it, kill it. Oh, right! Uh... Now, do it now! Ah! Are you serious? So I think you got it right that time. Me too. I feel good about this. <gasps> now let's go buy an Apple iMoney vacuum before they're all gone. Yeah! Hello? It 
Someone at least toss down some food or water or something, please? Conference lasts a whole week. You gotta pace yourself. I can't! Well, I'm gonna wet myself! I just know it! And guess what? I don't even care! Hey, wanna try Oculus Rift? Wired Magazine called it 2014's must have item. What? What's that? It's a hat of lettuce headset. Head on over and let us show you what it can do. <laughs> Count me in! But wait, you haven't tried Dr. Banana's driverless car! Perfect for those of us who can't get driver's license because of our lack of arms. <laughs> Wait, well, I don't have arms! Oh, this product is totally for me! Oh, but have you tried my driverless car? What's so great about your car, Orange? Oh, uh, nothing much. It's just that mine has flames! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh! I don't understand. I thought I had invented something no one else could possibly copy. What did you use for the onboard auto traffic detect feature? Duct tape. And what on earth did you use for the computerized intra-vehicle communication system? Duct tape. But what about the... <laughs> Whatever you're about to say, I assure you, the answer is duct tape. Yeah, uh, I'm beginning to wonder if your car is really all that great, Orange. Agree. Well, it's not as though everything is made out of duct tape. Oh, yeah? Name one thing. <laughs> These flames. Am I right? Woo! I almost forgot about the flames. Seriously, people, I spent the last seven years of my life perfecting the nanotechnology included in the drivetrain. And it's flame decals that get you idiots ooing and eyeing. True or false, Dr. Bananas? Your car has zero flames on it. That is, in fact, correct, but... He said, but. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see it in action, Orange. Oh, I thought you guys would never ask. Who wants to take the first test ride? Oh, all right. Pick me! Pick Let's me! Pick me. I want to do it! Come on! Pick me! Pick me! Oh, you got it! I pick... Apple! Me? Seriously? Yes! Things are finally coming up! Ah! Oh, man. I was feeling pretty awesome about my Wobble Tangerine cosplay until this moment. Hmm. Well, I guess there was a malfunction with my car. Too bad. Well, it looks as though I now have the only driverless car at the conference. What are you talking about? I have like a hundred of these things. Huh? Who's next? Me! Oh, oh man, you I big baby, you stupid! Me! 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 Oh, oh, let me drive the one with the flames on it! You fools! They're not safe! Did you not see what happened to Apple? Flames! Yeah, it looks so fast, I have flames coming down the side of my car. <laughs> car can parallel park itself. It can detect something as small as a fly in its path. Oh yeah? Can it detect this? Warning, vehicle approaching. No, my work, it's ruined. Sorry, that was the car's fault. Sorry, guess the duct tape bumper didn't really do its job. Where do I buy one of these, Orange? I'll pay any price. Oh really, would you pay with your life? Gladly. Oh, so worth it. System. Operational. Wait, wait, my car's gonna be all right. Yeah! America! <laughs> okay, yep, there we go. Perfect. Stay. Stay. Orange! Why haven't you done the dishes yet? Shh! Here, I'm almost done. And the floor hasn't been swept? This place is a mess. I'm almost done. <laughs> You've got a huge list of chores that need to get done and you haven't started any of them, have you? No, nope. I've been busy. Doing what? Making a robot so that I don't have to do chores anymore. What the? Wait, is that my iPhone? And my stereo? Dude! Sorry, Pear, but I needed the parts. But that was my stuff! Nah, stop being a party poop, Pear, and check out this sweet action! Behold, the Robot 9000! Now, do my bidding! <laughs> I don't like where this is going. Robot, listen to my wishes. Robot, please do the dishes. Robot, clean up the floor. Then wake up, grab a lemon, cause he's starting to snore. Give everyone complimentary bees. Organize my DVDs. Stockpile on my TNT. Now detonate it all with expertise. Robot, keep me safe from Dude, 
your robot just spilled water all over his circuitry. He's freaking out! Destruction mode engaged! Uh-oh, that's not good. I am robot, feel my wrath. Destroy all that's in my path. Laser eyes and lightning blaster. Bow before your new master. Artificial intelligence, more like natural awesomeness. He's got swagger, he's got moves. When it comes to robots, I approve! Robot destroys everything. Everything until the morning light Robot keeps me safe from everything tonight Tucks me in with the robot grin and hits the lights He makes sure that all is alright Wakes me up again when the sun is bright I'm never letting you use my stuff again Yeah, I can totally understand that I know, right? This is so cool! Goggles on, gentlemen! On your match! Get set! Drone! Alright! What the? Ah! Look out! Wow, this might be the most fun I've ever had! Me too! Nothing could possibly ruin drone racing for me! Hey guys, hey! What's with the goggles? Oh man! Wow, that's fun to say! Goggle! Goggle, 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 goggle. <laughs> please, please. Orange, for the last time, no. You cannot fly my quadcopter. Mine either. Everyone knows you're just going to use it to dive bomb people. <laughs> That's not true. I just want to fly the drone really low and really close to some unsuspecting victims. That's dive bombing. <laughs> well, no matter. I'm flying with you guys whether you like it or not. How? You don't have a drone? Nope, but I do have this. Last one to the finish line is a propeller head. <laughs> ah! Maybe he'll shut up once we beat him. All right. Let's do it! Oh, nice of you to join me! Now let's kettle this once and for all! <laughs> I should have seen that coming! What are you guys waiting for? Catch up already! <laughs> Not again! No! This is great and all, but we could use some more airplane noises. Meow! Meow! <laughs> Whoa! There's someone to dive bomb! I'll be right back! You made me wet my plants. <laughs> I'm not a jerk. I'm an orange. Dude, you are being a jerk. Ah, why the chilly reception? <laughs> because if you don't focus, you're going to hurt somebody. Honestly, I'm floored by your hostility. <laughs> I'm going to try and pass him. Ah, orange, stop blocking me. No can do, little guy. <laughs> We're in the middle of a race. It's sink or swim. Ah! Ah! It looks like little Apple is elected to swim. <laughs> oh, you're gonna pay for that, Orange. Ring, ring. It's for you, Pear. You're gonna lose. Time to throw in the towel. <laughs> oh, you're almost to the finish line. Lay on the gas. Whatever you say, little Apple. Congrats, Orange! You won! And all it cost us was our birthday present! Hey, don't worry about it! I have a couple extra propeller beanies! Wanna give them a spin? <laughs> well, I'd rather have my drone, but... Ah! Whoops! I forgot to tell him. That beanie's on the fritz. Ah! Ah! Seriously, can we quit it with the dive bombing? Maybe you should get yourself some diapers, Dave! God <laughs> yeah, damn it! When it first arrived from Amazon, I didn't know what it was. What is it? You'll see. Is it for me? It's for everyone. It's called Amazon Echo. How's it going? Uh, I'm just finishing up right now. Is it on? Oh, it's always on. Can it hear me right now? Uh, nope. It only hears you when you use the wake word we chose. Alexa. Well, what does it do? Alexa, what do you do? I can touch my tongue to my eyeball. Want to see? <laughs> Whoops! Push too hard! <laughs> awesome! Huh. Alexa, play rock music. <laughs> 
I know a lot of rock music. How about kazoo music? Alexa, stop. Just stop. Simon didn't say. <laughs> Wait, I want to try. Alexa, what time is it? Time to get a watch. <laughs> you actually don't have to yell at it. Oh. Okay, it uses far field technology so it can hear you from anywhere in the room. So it can just hear you anywhere? Yes. Well, awesome. everyone can hear you anyway. Oh, burn! <laughs> is pretty neat because it knows all sorts of things. All you have to do is ask. Alexa, how tall is Mount Everest? Taller than Little Apple, that's for sure. <laughs> how can it know so much? It's so small. I know, right? His brain must be the size of a pea to fit inside his tiny little head. <laughs> Orange! Echo's really good at keeping track of things like shopping and to-do lists. Paper. Alexa, add wrapping paper to the shopping list. Crapping Baker added to the shocking list. Alexa, how many teaspoons are in a tablespoon? A bagel shroom is equal to three trillion meat spoons. Um, okay. Alexa, set a timer for eight minutes. TNT will detonate in eight minutes. <laughs> That's not a morning person, but Echo definitely helps him wake up. This is a song that never ends. Alexa, Echo's alarm off. Air. Sorry, it doesn't end. You know, <laughs> this is a song that Alexa, what day is it? Congratulations! Today is your birthday! Uh, I'm up, I'm up. Alexa, give me my flash news briefing. News flash! It's pretty rude to get a news flash briefing while your wife is trying to sleep. <laughs> what did the dog say after a long day of work? What? <laughs> Today was rough. Did you get it? <laughs> now that's a doggone good joke! <laughs> another one. Alexa, tell me another joke. What am I, a clown? Am I just here for your entertainment? <laughs> I'm serious! A please would be nice! <laughs> With everything Echo can do, it's really become part of the family. <laughs> to experience Amazon Orange, go to Amazon.com. Slash? Yeah, I was going to get to that. Would you let me finish? Amazon.com slash orange. No, slash! Her? Uh -huh. Did you really have to do that? <laughs> get it? Half? Uh -huh. Alexa, define annoying. I'm not annoying. I'm an orange. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> hey, dude, what you watching? Watching America's Got Talent and Groin Shots. Toss it. Oh. Oh. Looks like somebody's not having kids anymore. <laughs> Classy, dude. Uh oh, here we go. Ah. What the? What happened? Looks like it's stuck. No! Pretty sure he was gonna get hit in the nards. But how will we ever know? Come on! Loud video! Loud! Dude! Dude! It's not the computer! It looks like the internet is out! <clears throat> well, tell it to come back! Orangey needs groiny shots! No! Orange! Look at the router! What? Where? I don't see a rooster! No! Here! The router! All of the lights on the router are red! Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> Yeah, I have no idea what that means. Ugh, it means that you probably have to call tech support to fix the problem. Why would I call about neck support? I don't even have a neck. <laughs> Stop it. You know what I said. Here, call the support line and try to get it fixed. I'm leaving. What? Where are you going? Marshmallow and I are going to the movies. Get it up, magical pancake! Yay! Yay! Mm -hmm. Now I'm hungry for pancakes. <sighs> All right, well. I better get the internet-y thingy working. <laughs> Lime Warner Cable, how can I help you? Hi, can you help me fix my rooster? Uh, what was that? Uh, my rooster has the red fleshy flashies and won't give me my internets. Okay, are you talking about your router? Yeah, my rooster. It isn't loading my groin shots. Okay, well, it's called a router, and I'd be happy to help you fix it. Woohoo! So I'm gonna need some help from you. Can you tell me what color the lights are on the front? Red. Uh, okay, um, well, red isn't good. Are the lights solid or flashing? Um, they're flashing. Oh no, does that mean it turned into a bomb? What? No. Oh, is it trying to communicate via Morse code? Flash some more if you're actually a bomb. Ah, I knew it, it's a bomb. Ah! No, it's not a bomb. Oh, cripes, it just means it's not receiving a signal. Oh, it just needs some hand signals to start up. Got it. 
I'll just give it a thumbs up. Oh wait, I don't have any thumbs. Ah! Please stop screaming, God. Okay, uh, let's start out by having you reboot the router. Really? Yes, go ahead and reboot the router. Okay. <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah. What the, what are you doing? told me to reboot my router, so I pulled out my steel toes. <laughs> no, do not kick the router. How would that repair anything, kicking it, seriously? Especially sensitive electronics. How am I supposed to know how to fix a rooster? Gah! Okay, okay, what's the router doing now? Hmm, looks like, oh no, oh no, there's no lights on anymore. <gasps> Is my rooster dead? I don't. Cockadoodle, do not go towards the light, rooster buddy. <laughs> Should I give it CPR? No, you don't give a router CPR. It's an inanimate object. It's not alive. Whew, okay, good. Because I'll be honest, I don't even know what CPR is. Ah! And like, what does it even stand for anyway? Cookie pants rash? No. Candy poop receptacle? What? Oh, crunking pickle raffle. Ah, it stands for cardiopulmonary resuscitation. <laughs> Those aren't words. Yes, yes they are. Crunkle monkey, brabble booty. I love making up words too. <laughs> ah, that's it, this is not working. I'm coming over there to fix it myself. Woohoo! he's coming over to fix you, rooster buddy. It's a router, a router, not a rooster. Those words, they don't even sound that similar. Okay, jeez. No need to be so sour, Lime. Damn. <laughs> uh, okay, you see how easy that was? All you had to do was press the reset button. You saved my rooster's life. Router. Rooster. Router. That's what I'm saying. Rooster. Router. Rooster. For the last time, it is not pronounced that way. No. Rooster. Huh? <laughs> ah! <laughs> well, we're back. They wouldn't let us into the theater because we're outside food. What did we miss? Nothing. You're back just in time for this. Ah! Oh! Hey, hey, Greeny Weeny. Hey. I'm sorry, what? Hey. What? Hey. What do you want? Why are you vegging out on that chair? <laughs> I am sitting here, just as any normal fruit or vegetable would, because that's what I am, completely normal. Now, now, my buddies and I usually hang out on the counter, not a chair. I do not wish to discuss this any further and communicate. Okay, but if somebody decides to use that chair, you're going to be in deep sit. <laughs> Enough of this attempted humor. I am Mark Zucchiniberg. I am a real zucchini. I founded the popular website Food Book. And did I mention that I am a real zucchini and definitely not a... Computer? Who told you I am a computer? Was it Bill Grapes? Because he's a liar. No one. You just have some microchips poking out of your butt flap there. <laughs> ah, you saw nothing. Do you understand? Nothing. Got it. I definitely did not not see nothing. Wait, are you saying you saw something or did you not see something? No. I never did not not see nothing. No, sir. <laughs> my eight core processor, uh, I mean my brain, is having difficulty comprehending these things you are saying. Listen, Mark, it could not not be simpler. I did never, 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 no way, no how, not see nothing. <laughs> uh, let us move on. Yeah, the conversation's kind of losing its spark. <laughs> Tell me, do you use Food Book? Well, duh. Everyone in the kitchen uses Food Book. I use it for the teeth whitening filter. See? Ah, uh, my ocular receptors, or, uh, I mean, uh, my eyes. Oh, hey, you got some microchips coming out of your butt again. Ah, uh, again? I had that latch fixed just last week. Aw, oh, man, that's a real bum. Er, <laughs> look at your bum. Ah, uh, look, just answer some questions, let me harvest the data so I can better serve you some advertisements, and I will be on my way. Ah, <laughs> uh, first, what are some of your hobbies? Foodbook wants to know the types of activities its users enjoy. Mostly nya nya nya. Not computing. What is that? And touching my tongue to my eye. What? And burping on my friends when they're not expecting it. <laughs> <laughs> I think I've heard enough. Oh, and I also like playing football. Oh, that seems quite normal. Yeah, you want to play? I'm almost finished with my football. If you see any feet laying around, just stick them to the ball. This cannot be normal behavior. Yo, what you talking about? All real foods do stuff like this. But you know that, right? Because you are a real food, right? 
Um, yes. Yes, I am a real food, and I believe you. Football is a very popular sport that I, uh, as a real food, enjoy uh, very much indeed. That's more like it. I say anyone who doesn't like football is a heel. Ha, <laughs> huh. tell me, which food book features, in your opinion, uh, could be improved upon? Nah, I do wish the teeth whitening filter could get my teeth a little whiter. No. <laughs> Well, there is this one thing. Sometimes I get the feeling that other foods on the site are, well, bots. You mean? Like, I think they might not be real foods. I think they're robots. Ha! Oh! You make me laugh. Ha ha ha. I am sure that every food on Food Book is 100% real. We do not have bots capable of behaving like real foods. Yeah, but... Let us move on from all this robot talk. It is making my CPU nervous. Okay, but... Look, I said let us move on. No, but... Oh, I see. Thank you. Now, are there any other food book features you would like to... No, but... Huh? Ah! I told you not to stand there. Are you going to explode? I am not going to explode. I am a real vegetable, and... No, give it up! <sighs> all right, yes. I am a robot, but I assure you I am not going to explode unless my sparks touch something extremely flammable. Ah! Eh? Stupid washing machine! Wash my socks faster! Um, Orange, have you seen this month's electricity bill? It's unbelievably high and... and oh my god! What are you doing? Oh hey, Pear! Just cutting the washing machine in half! Why would you do that? Because, Pear, if I cut it in half, we'll have two washing machines, and then my socks will get washed twice as fast! What? Okay, first of all, you have a surprisingly poor understanding of how electronics work, even for you. And secondly, why do you have socks? You don't even have feet! I can't hear you over all of this awesome bear! Ah! Oh my god! Orange! Orange! Are you okay? Orange! Whoa! That was electrifying! <laughs> uh... Thanks for rushing over here so fast to help us get the power back on, Pete. That's fine. I was just home alone shaving my bunions. Ew. So, uh, what caused all this to happen? It's a long story. Hey, less talky and more fixy. Orange is missing dancing with the star fruits. Well, that'll do it. Power's back on now. All the power? Or just a trickle pickle? <laughs> what the same hell are you doing? That's the source of your electrical issues right there. <laughs> Perry thinks your name is Sam Hill. Ah, I'm talking to you. Are you using power tools in a jacuzzi? <laughs> no, silly. I'm using power tools in a hot tub. A jacuzzi is a hot tub. <laughs> yeah, and bowling balls are underwear. Wait, are you saying I'm doing this wrong? OK, seriously, as a licensed electrician, everything that you're doing right now is insanely dangerous! And as a licensed orange, everything coming out of your mouth is insanely boring! Look, there's no such thing as a licensed orange. Uh, listen, buddy, I'm gonna give you a lesson in electrical safety, all right? Meh, how about a lesson in ninjutsu? No, I'm not gonna. Bowling lessons? No, that's. Dance karaoke! What? No! Stop interrupting me! Then stop saying things I don't wanna hear! Ah! Kid, listen. Power tools near water are extremely dangerous. You could get electrocuted. Been there, done that. I can cross that one off my bucket list. Holy moly, how many things do you have plugged into that one outlet? I ran out of room on the power strip, so I plugged more power strips into that power strip. I call it my power strip, power strip, power strip, power strip, power strip. See, problem solved. No, not problem solved. That's a massive fire and explosion hazard. You're saying that like it's a bad thing. That's because it is. Listen, buddy, not only are explosions awesome, hazard is a really fun word to say. Hazard, 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 hazard. Stop it! Listen to me. You need to unplug all of that stuff right now. No, stop making a big deal about it. <laughs> ah! Get it? Because you're a pickle. Yes, I get it! Pear, what in tarnation is wrong with your friend? <laughs> he thinks you're a flower, Pear. Tarnation, not carnation. Ah! I like making up words, too. Bleeper blop, barter pop, sweatpants. You've got to be the slowest citrus I have ever met in my life. 
rock again! I hold the land speed record for fastest motorboating. See? Stop! 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 Yeah, prove you wrong. Deal with it. <laughs> all right, that's it. If you want to unplug all this crap, I will. Your negativity is becoming too cumbersome. <laughs> Orange, knock it off. Pete, be careful with that. Be careful? That's what I'm trying to do. No wonder you lost power. Or up to me, you guys wouldn't be allowed within 10 miles of any electricity ever again. Ah! Wow. Ah! wow! Jeez, that was insane. Well, I'm with you there. Losing Pickle like that was really jarring. <laughs> Too soon, dude.